um, since you, you know, you are no well known as the fastest talking man, um, I want to know whether or not that you actually had practice in like, um, even like even today that you practice on mastering your craft on talking faster than a normal human being. Well, definitely when I taught myself how to do it when I was 12, I just did it over and over and over and over and over and over again. And, you know, I had five sisters, so I would like put them in my bedroom and make them sit in the corner and I'd say something really fast and they'd go, what did I say? What did I say? What did I say? And kind of tortured them with that. <laughs> now I'm lucky, you know, I was told to shut up for about 15 years and then all of a sudden it was my son, the fast talker, is home. So uh, <laughs> it, it was a little bit of a turnaround. Now I'm lucky I work enough that just practicing the scripts and doing whatever keeps it in, uh, keeps, keeps the, the lips limber. And then I will sometimes, usually when I'm working, I, I do my warm-ups. I have a series of warm-up exercises that I do. I generally do them in the shower because I find it annoys the fewest amount of people that way. <laughs> and uh, just, you know, keep limber and, and hope for the best. Some days it doesn't work. I've had a couple of days where I go to work, I can't say three words without tripping over them. But usually, knock on wood, it's pretty good.